Hey, how you doing? This is Tom, and this is Tom's Radio Room Show. And I apologize for the noise of the wall air conditioner. I'm down in my shop, and it's still quite hot here in Florida. Got up to 95 here in Florida today. It's 7 p.m. right now. But anyway, I was going to show you via this Google map the configuration of the Slinky antenna. It's kind of the best I could come up with. Uh, easily because I'm not allowed to get on the roof anymore and I didn't have any help so I did the best I could just not ideal so right about here this is the second story roof this is the first story it's put level right about here is where the 20 foot pole metal pole is attached to the side of the house and the antenna this particular antenna is attached at about 12 to 15 feet. Way too low, but it's the best I can come up with. And one leg extends this way, which is northwest, and it goes under these trees here. It doesn't touch any branches or anything, and then ties into a limb in this tree, and it's stretched out about 30 feet. The other leg I wanted to put back this way so that it would be kind of straight. But when I did the slinky antenna where it was near the pole was touching the pole. So I had to move it over this way. And so it stretched out about 20 feet in this direction. So it goes like this. Kind of a dog leg or L. So it's, it's, it's not what I wanted, but that's the best I could come up with. So anyway, I did some testing with my analyzer. And I'll try to show you that right here. Okay, here's the testing with the analyzer. I did this about 20 minutes ago. This is SWR versus frequency. And I started it down here at 3 megahertz and went up to 30 megahertz. And you can see it's not doing too good, although it doesn't go too much higher than 10, SWR 10, which is not very good and it's terrible if you're going to transmit. So we've got a couple of spots where it goes down, they're not in the right place. There's one there at 6 megahertz. The SWR is 1.56, and there's one here at 18 megahertz, it's 1.13, and then there's one over here at 29, almost 30 megahertz, and it's 1.25. So you can see when it goes down, it's very narrow, very, very narrow frequency range. So there's uh, Let's see, one, two, three, yeah, there's almost six at, I mean, excuse me, almost four at six megahertz, and then it's four again at 6.6, .6, pretty narrow, and then over here, it's almost four at 17, and it's four at almost 19. So the bands that I knew normally listen to is between 9 and 10 megahertz and it's <laughs> it's at its worst which is an SWR 10. Now an SWR for listening is not quite as important as transmit. So it may still work pretty good for listening definitely wouldn't want to transmit on it without a tuner to get that SWR down using a tuner, antenna tuner. So that's kind of the results I've gotten. Um, I can go back to the, my favorite one down here is the 31 foot MFJ and it looks much better. It's, uh, let's go to about four. There's about four that starts at 6.44. Four. 
and it lasts to 9.45. So we're in my 31 meter band here, and then it's down less than four here at 18, 19, and it stays down to about 23. So it's doing much better. Uh, I can load one more, which was the uh, new antenna, which is the uh, 40 to 6 meter OCF. Let's see if I get the same band. That's not the same band. Let me try a different one. Probably this one, maybe. Yeah, this is 30, I mean, 3 to 30. And you can see it, it's doing pretty good. I mean, let's see, what's uh, my favorite band? Eh, not so good. <laughs> not so good at 31 meters. But this is designed for 40 meters, uh, for instance, which would be um, 7 megahertz so it's pretty good down at seven megahertz and it's designed for 20 meters whereas which is about 14 very good down there and it's designed for 10 uh, 10 would be up here about there so it's good so this antenna which comes from Tim does have low SWRs where you want them that's well, where did where it's designed for. So I just thought I'd show you that. Uh, we'll quickly go back to the Slinky antenna uh, right there. We'll open that one. And there's the Slinky from 3 megahertz to 30. Not too good, not too good. So uh, we'll hook it up to a radio and see how it pulls in the stations. That's it. If you enjoyed the show, please give me a thumbs up. Have a great day. Bye-bye.